Hello, this is Chef John from foodwishes.com with pickled Padron peppers. That's right, I picked a peck of Padron peppers, and by pick I mean bought at the store, and by peck I mean, well, whatever you see on the towel there. I'm not sure how big a peck is, so let's just say it's that much. So I'm going to take these peppers and basically make a flavored vinegar in a quart jar. I've never done this exact recipe before, but you know what? It's all part of the fun. All right, so my Padron peppers have been washed and dried. By the way, please read the blog post about Padron peppers. So fascinating. I'm going to take a large skillet on medium-high heat. I'm going to put in just barely like a half a teaspoon of vegetable oil just to coat the bottom. When that pan gets real hot, I'm going to throw in my peppers, and I'm going to just move them around for about, I don't know, four or five minutes. I'm not cooking them. I don't need to char the skin because I'm going to peel them or anything like that. I just want to sort of wake up the oils, wake up the flavor, just have a little bit of blistering going on. So basically they're going to get sort of shiny and sweaty looking and a little blistered. And by the way, see that little smoke coming off of the pan? Try to be in a very well ventilated place. That's basically tear gas. So if you've ever wondered what tear gas felt like, don't do this in a kitchen that has good ventilation and you'll find out. All right, so once those look kind of like that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take a one quart mason jar, just a standard two-piece lid home canning jar. I'm going to throw my peppers in. Now remember, these peppers were not sliced or poked or popped, so they're full of air, but that's okay. We're going to press them all down, and once all my peppers are in the jar, I'm going to make my brine, which is basically standard plain distilled white vinegar, garlic, red chili flakes, black peppercorns, and sugar. All right, give that a stir. Bring it to a boil. And as soon as it boils, I'm going to go ahead and fill up my mason jar. So the peppers got a little blistering in the pan. Now they're going to sit in this hot brine until it cools. So they are going to soften a little bit. All right, so I'm going to fill that up all the way. And you can see all the air bubbles coming up. I'm going to use a spoon to sort of help that. Just keep poking it down. Any trapped air will come up to the top. And then we're pretty much done. Put the lid on, screw the ring, and that will sit at room temperature for about an hour and a half. A vacuum will be formed, the lid will seal, and this will keep basically indefinitely. So I'm gonna use the peppers as I would any pickled pepper. What I really am after is that beautiful, slightly sweet, flavorful, tangy, spicy vinegar. And I'm gonna use that on things like rice and things like salad dressing and things like marinades. And quite frankly, you're not going to believe some of the things I do with this vinegar, okay? So stay tuned. Go check out foodwishes.com for all the ingredient amounts. And as always, enjoy.